Well, good morning, everybody. It's Bobby from Bobby's Hobbies, and I have what is here, a very nice locomotive. I believe I worked on it in the recent past. It's by Lima. Um, you can see it's gorgeous. It's European style. 282 steam engine. I'm not sure of the nickname designation in Europe. Um, and I have to come to think of it, I'm not sure what a 282 is here now. Maybe a consolidation. Well, that might be a 280, but anyway, <clears throat> so I put it on the track the other day, and she didn't want to go. So, um, all right, now it's poss anything's possible. Motor could have seized up, could be dirty. I could have the wrong tender that has the wrong polarity. So we're going to do the old-fashioned test it with leads at full power, because I want to see if I can get any life out of this. Hmm. Nothing. Is my power on? Yes. Let's, let's just test this on a... I um, don't even have any motors lying around. That's great. But... <clears throat> No spark. Wow. She's like totally dead. That's really surprising. Um, let me zoom out a little bit because I think I'm going to miss some of the action here by having it so narrowly focused. So, when all else fails, you really have to get inside. I think this is the one where this has to come off, believe it or not. Oh, she's not really working. <laughs> I haven't been down here a while. At the moment, I don't know. Where my tools are. That's disappointing. Oh wait, I found it. Ta -da. This looks good. Is it really good or not? I'm not sure. No. Here's a tiny one. Make that unlocked. Wow, this one's really giving me some problems.
This is one son of a gun. That's something. That's it's partially loose. That's good. Here's another one. I gotta think that this is part of it. All right. Getting there. All right. Okay. Let's put these pieces out of the way in safety. Leave that bolt there, that other bolt is there. So now you see it, it's exposed. Um, of course that bolt fell out now, that's all right. <clears throat> so, now we should be able to take a real good visual by putting leads directly on this motor and see if the motor has life and it's something else. And a lot of power. Okay, so the motor's running beautifully. So what was failing? But what's going on with this? We do see that this power is going to this. When this bolt comes up through here, that's touching that. So we can clip this on here. Now let's see where the other pickup is. All right. All right, so she's basically fine, but she's got some, when it's put together, some electrical connectivity problem. It's good to know that the motor's okay. Again, just to test it again without any interference on the drive system. I got to get to work today, so we're going to have to put this aside. All right, she's basically okay. Just needs some kind of adjustment. See there a light in here? Can you see it? Yeah, she's got one light. Alright, we'll have to work on this later. But at least we know she's fundamentally sound. Just need some adjustment. That's what you got to do and deal with with toy trains. Hey, I hope you're enjoying this video and my channel. And please like and subscribe if you have a mind to. Really, really helps. And I thank you so much. And have a great, wonderful day. Bye for now.